Well, you're going to want to bring your kids to the TV for our next guest. She is the teen star from the hit Disney show, Shake It Up. Probably should have mentioned this to you sooner, but I kind of invited... Cece to come? Yes, but it's not going to be like last time, I promise, because she's bringing a date. That'll be fun, right? As much fun as dinner on the Titanic. <laughs> well, I bet dinner on the Titanic was really fun. You know, until the not enough lifeboats thing. <laughs> Yeah, that's and when she's not busy with her show, she's recording albums, filming music videos, writing books. She's only 16. <laughs> Zendaya joins us now. Good morning to you. Good morning. Hello, Rocky Blue. <laughs> so you're in your, th is it the third season already of Shake It Up? Yes, yes. We finished the third season. So it's been quite an amazing journey, and I can't believe it's already three seasons. It feels like we're still on number one, you know, so it goes really fast. And for folks who are unfamiliar with uh, Shake It Up, what's it about? Well, Shake It Up is a buddy comedy kind of built around dance, and it's about two best friends who dream to become professional dancers, and um, they're two little hip-hop girls, and they live in Chicago, and they kind of get to live out their dream on this show called Shake It Up Chicago. You know what's so interesting about these younger shows where we see young teen actresses and actors, it, it almost seems like the real-life things that you're passionate about play out in the shows as well so they're they're making use of your real life talent you are a real life singer you have a band <laughs> yeah uh, I think you know that's a really good thing I think especially just to see young talent in general I feel like it's very very important especially for the younger people to see kids closer to the age doing what they might love to do or being sure. able to just you know kind of see that inspiration I think is really good and good to get started seeing so when I made my band I, I really wanted to make sure I had young elements in it and I really wanted young kids to be a part of it so I actually have an 11 year old bass player so do you have to pay him a, a salary or just an allowance uh, I, okay, the, I don't even know about all that but he of course he gets paid and you, guys were, too. Yeah, and you guys were busy because you were performing yesterday up in Saratoga New York right yes we were we and God bless you you traveled all night to be with us here I today. I did. I did. I got, I got there at like 2 o'clock in the morning, and then I had to sleep. I can't believe I'm awake right now, to be honest. And I'm <laughs> quite perky, to be honest. Yeah, 16-year-old yeah. uh, during the summer, awake at 7.26 in the morning. <laughs> You're one, of the, you're, you're one of the few who could pull it up. Now, tell me about the book that's going to be coming out this summer. Um, I wrote a tween advice book called um, Between You and Me. The whole tween thing in there. Yep. Um, but I think it's just, you know, I had a very smooth tween transition. I think it's, it's kind of a time that isn't really given enough credit because you're, you're not really a teenager yet. You're not a kid. You get the responsibilities you want and you don't get enough. And so um, I think it's just to kind of make that transition smoother. And I know there's a lot of stuff going on in school and it's just a lot of things happening. And I feel like I just wanted to help kids and give it kind of like a fresher mindset because it just happened. You know sure. what I'm saying? I just got out of that. So it's just fresh on my mind and it's something I feel like I can I can help out a little. Very good. And speaking of fresh on your mind, you got you got a brand new single out right now on oh, yeah. iTunes, right? Yes, it's coming out tomorrow. I'm so excited. <laughs> what's it called? It's called Replay. Replay. And what's it about? Oh, uh, well, it's about, um, the song is basically saying, you know, I think for me personally, it can work for anything, any kind of passion, any kind of thing you truly love. It can be a person, it could be a hobby, but um, just when you love something so much, you just want to constantly put it on replay, and you just want to constantly over be around and, and, over. and over and over and over again. So that's kind of what it's, what it's about for that's me. That's great. Yeah. I just saw your fingernails. Oh my god, these old things. <laughs> Very cool. I like how they don't all match each other, no. but they still they make a nice grouping. <laughs> uh, continued success to you. Thank uh, you. Amazing success so far, Zendaya. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me.